Hello everyone and welcome to week one of English 120. Hopefully you already received the announcement that I sent out um, earlier this week. If not, it's found under the announcements. I'll also be sending one out um, the night before um, our class begins just so that you're ready to go and you have a chance to look at our syllabus which is listed here. Um, our module zero has been live all week. Just a heads up that there is some stuff you need to do in here. So please make sure you click through and how you do that is you click on start here and scroll down, read through everything and then click through next until you get through the whole section. One thing that's really important after you get to watch my silly little video and say hi to me is for you to also participate in the um, about you conversation which is set right here. You'll notice that I have already posted something, but you haven't, so please, I wanna hear from you. You will be posting your own post um, with a picture, and just so that you know how you embed a picture is you hit, you're gonna hit reply, and you'll see all this information here. You're gonna say, dear class, and write your response, answer all the questions, and when you wanna insert a photo, you're gonna click on this button, and you can, I, you can upload an image right here and it'll insert it into the page and you can control the size of it and everything like that. All right, let's go back to, sorry. Um, let's go back to modules. So, um, but hopefully you've already gone through all of week zero and now we can go through week one. So in week one, um, we will be doing a lot. Um, this is the kickoff of our class. Um, this week I will always have, um, and every week I will always have this kind of introduction. Um, this is where you clicked on this video. Um, the introduction is just to tell you a little bit about um, what is going on this week. Um, you're going to be learning about active reading, which is how we're going to learn how to read text that maybe are a little harder than we're used to. Um, so you're going to First, watch this embedded video, which look at you, you're already a step ahead. Um, then you're gonna review the orientation to online research and take the quiz associated with it. Um, that's just the next thing you'll see as you click through um, right here. You'll see it starts right here. Welcome to academic research. Um, if you go back, um, you'll also um, need to take the quiz at the end of that, and um, you always get two attempts at your research quizzes. Um, so make sure if you get a really bad grade on the first one that you take a moment, go back through the content, and then take it again. Um, you want to actively read um, the, uh, the short story that I uploaded called Snow is a Promise. This is by Sonora Bab, and there's a PDF of that content under this week's um, contents under module one. You also need to complete your active reading assignment about the text by Sonora Bab. Um, that is going to be due this Sunday, August 16th. So please make sure you get on that right away. Finally, you are going to participate in a video discussion about the text using Flipgrid. Flipgrid is like a, a really easy video um, chat that we're going to do. And um, all you have to do is go in there and I'll show you really quickly. Go in there really quickly. Sorry, we'll click through to it. Sorry, my dog is attacking me. <laughs> this is Gus, you guys can meet him. This is Gus. He's blind and um, he wants my attention right now. So um, you're gonna watch the video on Sonora Bab. You're gonna learn about what active reading is and don't miss that there's a little video in here for you to watch. Um, right here, so make sure you watch it. Then you're going to um, participate. You're going to actively read Snow as a Promise and upload your notes here. Um, then you're going to read Snow as a Promise as you actively after you actively read it. Then you are going to participate in this discussion forum. We'll let it load. Um, so discussing snow is a promise right here. You'll see that um, you get to record a response. You're gonna click on that right here. And it's gonna, it's gonna, it's not gonna work right now because I'm on a different camera. 
but um, you are just going to set up your camera and then record it. You have two minutes to answer your questions. You'll notice that there's some um, uh, there's some uh, there's some uh, questions in here and it'll be real obvious what they are when you get to it. Okay, guys. Um, then at the end, when you get to the end of our module, you'll see that there is a module one wrap up. This tells you um, what you learned this week, what you did, so you can make sure you finished all your assignments and then what's next. The one thing I don't want you to forget is this class has two classes. This is English 120. This is where you're going to be doing the majority of your work. The second part is English 95, and that's a whole nother little um, place where we're going to be meeting up and I will be recording a live lecture in English 95. Now, one of the first things you'll get from me in English 95 is a survey to find out what times work best for you. We'll try to find the time that works for the most people. It's not required that you attend those. But it's always a lot more fun if you do. There'll be um, short zooms, um, and there will be assignments associated with them. So we'll be building on our active reading, what we've done in this class this week, in English 95, and you'll see that correspondence every week. All right, guys. Uh, if you have any questions, my name is Dr. Dunkel, and this is my email right here. I promise to get back to you within 24 hours, unless of course it's a weekend, and then it might be 48 hours. I look forward to working with you and I will see you online.